what's going on guys my name's Eclipse and today we're gonna be doing something totally different than I've ever done before and to be honest I don't think anyone has ever done this on YouTube so hopefully we can be the first but essentially I'm gonna hop into a two versus two friendly battle and all four players involved are only going to be using building decks now there is one exception and I said people can use the mirror if they want the mirror is technically a spell but they're gonna be mirroring a building so overall the main goal is to fill up the entire arena with buildings I don't know if anyone's actually going to win this so this may be awesome or who knows it's probably just gonna end in a massive failure but regardless of the results hopefully this makes for an entertaining video now if you go to enjoy this video please give it a like down below and if you're new remember to subscribe for more stupidish cool content here goes nothing I'm sending the friendly battle out hopefully everyone who joins has the the proper deck with my luck watch someone join with like three musketeers and just absolutely wreck us so there's my teammate cheeseburgers deck I have a similar deck as well and I think the only way to win this is to just go all out so expo and cannon there's a bar but um I don't even oh my god what do we do at this point <laughs> I'm gonna stick another cannon down. There's a lot of stuff over there. I guess we're just gonna continue spamming everything There's no way we're actually going to finish this battle It's just gonna end in a six minute draw, but maybe this is awesome I may have to do a second battle in this video where only half the people have buildings and then the other half have to push that may be awesome, but for now, we're gonna try our best to actually get to this tower. Hopefully this mortar can sneak a shot off. They have an expo, it may actually do well. Look at all the crap they have right now. This is probably one of the craziest battles I've ever witnessed. Once two times the elixir comes though, keep in mind, we're gonna have both halves of the arena absolutely filled up with buildings, and it's just gonna look so funny. Now I'm thinking we need defensive buildings. Actually, they may get some hits off soon. I'm gonna stick a bomb tower down just because it has the most hit points in the game at least I think it does for building so right here we have the bomb tower down that's helping out but their expo and cannon is actually doing really well so hopefully our cannon can help out take care of that mortar and right now we're we're definitely on the lower end of this cheeseburger and I we need to get some more buildings down ASAP because if you're looking up top they have two furnaces plus they have tombstones and I'm sure they're building up for a massive push on top of that I think our only way to win this is to like push the other side that expo is about to get absolutely wrecked um, I'm thinking about putting a mortar down right there hopefully it goes down in time we really need more buildings for this right side because right now this isn't gonna go well we may actually lose this battle they are getting through look at their line of defense right now they have mortar expo and bomb tower they haven't got any hits off on our tower yet but they've been pretty close a few times this is gonna be crazy I didn't even realize this but it is two times elixir oh my god I'm pretty sure we are done I need to keep on cycling buildings because they are actually getting very close to our towers okay let's just completely overload this right side um oh god more buildings so let's put uh I'm thinking about putting a can Cannon down but unfortunately that Tesla was just gonna blast it so I put a mortar down instead now if you're looking up top I feel like they just have way more buildings than us I don't know if they're doing better or what I mean it's kind of hard to do good in here but three minutes has passed already this battle really isn't going anywhere so instead of making you guys watch the full three minute overtime I think we're just gonna end it here I'm no longer gonna put troops down I'm just gonna say good game and let's finish up this matchup I'm thinking in the next battle though cheeseburger and I are gonna keep our building deck and we're gonna have to defend a whole bunch of troops from the enemy okay so I just sent out the request again I'm with cheeseburger we have the defense only deck I made no changes since that last battle and the other people ultimate royale and scamp both of them should have only troops and no spells or buildings at all so the main goal of this is to just defend them. I don't know if we're even going to be able to. It's definitely going to be an interesting battle. So we have a golem right off the bat. We have enough buildings over there though to kind of screw everything up. How are we supposed to stop the bats? Oh my god, they have a lot of stuff inbound right now. We need to get all of this out of here ASAP. The golem is going down. We stopped the hog rider. I didn't think that defense was going to work out as planned. And keep in mind, my teammate and I do have the expo and mortar. So we can still technically pull off a win here I'm gonna slap a mortar down on that left side my teammate has the cannon in front but geez they have a mega knight 
Hopefully, cheeseburgers can get a Tesla down. I'm going to stick a fire. Ooh, a yeah, a furnace. I almost called the furnace a fire spirit. Even though it uses fire spirits, not the same thing. But there's the Mega Knight. That thing is going down. We do have the Ice Golem and the Bomber to deal with as well. But again, we had another de decent defense. I'm going to stick a Tesla down there just so we can avoid as much damage as possible. But oh my god, their Dark Goblin just got a whole bunch of hits off. Not looking too good for us right now. But keep in mind, once two times Elixir comes this is gonna get crazy oh we can do something sick look at this so the bomb tower right now is gonna be protecting the expo from anything that goes in front of it oh there is a hog rider get the cannon down stat um let me get a cannon down of my own as well we need to stop all this i did just get some lag there like the cannon should have went down two seconds ago really not too big of a deal but wait for this this bomb tower is about to go insane ready for this come on bomb tower oh Okay, it's not working too well. So I guess at this point, we have to pull everything on over to the right side. They're breaching through right now. So I'm thinking... Oh my god, I burped. As I was saying though, I'm thinking in the next battle, I'm going to be someone attacking the defenses and I'm just going to bring an all air deck because one thing I'm noticing right now is it is super hard to counter air troops right now just because you only really have the furnace, arena tower, and the tesla. Maybe bringing an inferno would have been a smart play, but I guess you'll live and you'll learn. So this battle kind of winding down, there's 30 seconds left and I'm letting you all know right now, we do not stand a chance whatsoever. They just have so many troops on us this this just isn't working out in our favor so i think we're just gonna call this battle here there's not much we can do at this point. Okay, this is the deck we're going to be rocking with. I have the Lumberjack for his Rage Spell. I can pretty much cycle miners repeatedly. I have the Hunter and the Sparky to do Splash to other buildings. And then I have the Lava Hound as like my main tank. So I told the people, whoever is on my team, use troops. And whoever is on the other team, to use buildings. So hopefully they got the memo. I would like to have this go smoothly. So here are our two decks. And again, I'm hoping we are against two buildings right now. This should be good. I'm telling you, we're going to win. In. my deck is superior to theirs i already know it okay we're gonna put a dark goblin down there let's get a minor cycling up oh come on yes we have the ice golem tanking as well this could not have gone any more perfect so right here i'm thinking about putting the hunter down i don't quite know if i want to do that let's just chill off for now the pea shooter is going and literally obliterating everything so since that pea shooter just did so well i'm thinking we put a sparky in the back by the time it's fully charged and at the bridge it should be able to take out like one to two buildings per blast and i told you guys we are running the hunter as well because he does do splash damage so this should go really well for us now i am going to send a lumberjack down that right lane just because he's extremely fast and i'm hoping i can catch them off guard there goes the sparky we have so many troops right now the lumberjack reached the tower but look they cannot stop this right here and i kind of feel like a cheater because i assume this would be rough for them so we already have one tower down and we're just going to continue putting up the aggression the miner is over there we have the sparky alive with the hunter and the dark goblin they do not stand a chance right now so this battle is winding down i think this was like one of the faster battles of the video but i think we're just gonna call it quits here because that that was flawless and one thing which i don't think i've ever done on my channel for clash royale is a good old say hi to youtube so let's see what the clan has to say before the video does end okay here is the clan everyone's active right now like this is the prime time to record my clan's popping right now we have so many people willing to help out so let's just give a shout out to everyone in today's video ultimate royale scamp cheeseburger and it, it turns out those were the only people who helped so shout out to those three but of course there was a few other people in the clan who wanted to help as well they just weren't quick enough to the battles so guys i think we are going to be ending the video here if you thought this was interesting or cool or maybe i should do like a sequel let me know down in the comment section below but guys this has been eclipse thanks for watching and peace out